feel that your life has stopped? Do not give up. I was browsing YouTube today. I found someone's comment on a video online. About motivational speech. He was saying. I don't want to quit smoking. But my lazy life, my past life, and the thought of exile are taking my life away. Day by day I feel worthless. My life is meaningless. I'm useless of all. Life stopped many years ago. God's help. He has asked for help. Show me some way from the person who made the video. I found myself stopping at this comment a lot. I remember myself from several years ago. I was just the same. I hated life. I find everyone trying to talk to me about patience. But I didn't care what they talked about and my life became more difficult. I read the comment several times. I felt sad for him. I loved helping him and I wish I could talk to him face to face. Listen to him. Make him release all those worries that fill his chest. But I don't know him. I tried to make him rise again and face the difficulties of life. I shortened my comment and hoped to God that my help would reach him. And that he can live a happy happy life. I wrote to him in the comment. I've been through these circumstances like you and I was feeling very upset. But now I'm happy with my life. You must love yourself. You must help yourself. You must support and motivate yourself. Be patient and don't look at your mistakes in the past. See your future life. To be sure of my words, try to read about successful people. You will find that they met them in a difficult life but they insisted that they live happy and succeeded. With their patience and diligence, and their certainty that God will not leave them. Pray to God to help you. Because our success and overcoming any difficulties can only be achieved by sincerely praying to God and making sure that God will really help us. This was my comment to him. I wanted to tell him and tell you. Life is full of difficulties, but we really appreciate them. We can live happily. But we must make sure that this life is our destiny. And we live in the world in a test. Our lives are us who determine our happiness and sadness. And I have overcome the difficulties of life by several steps. And it is. I kept praying to God and praying constantly. I affirmed to myself that I am better and I deserve to live better. And when I remember the past and my mistakes. Grab a pen and paper and start writing about my future. I forgot the past so as not to be sad. I set my future in front of me to reach it. I don't see any difficulties around me so that they don't hinder me. Because I really wanted to change. I really wanted success and insisted on it. I believe that I should strive and the results are God's destiny. I knew that God gives us everything. But sometimes we forget his blessing on us. I realized that God rewards us because we called him to support us to overcome the difficulties of life. Change comes from within ourselves and God supports us. Be honest. Help yourself. You will achieve your dream. You will reach the top. Let your ambition be the energy that moves you. Be yourself. Overcome anything holding you back. In the end. God bless you. Pray Allah. Be the best. Live a better life. Because you are the best. You deserve the best. Happiest in your life. God loves us. God cares about us. God help us and take care of us. Live a satisfied life. Be happy in your life. Better life.